I'm Don Dunlap, and I'm a watercolor artist from Colorado Springs. I've been painting in oils and watercolors for 40 years, and that's it. <laughs> did, did I ruin it? <laughs> no, that's great, that's great. <laughs> I would describe the body of my work as uh, very loose and casual. It's not tight in any way. I, I use a lot of uh, liberties in doing my paintings. I, I, instead of making a tree two foot tall, I can make it four foot tall and put it in front of the, the small trees. And, and in other words, you can, you can do whatever your imag imagination will take you to, to do. Painting Colorado Autumn came out kind of by accident. I was trying to create a certain image and it didn't work and I started rubbing some of the color out to replace it with new color and I liked it better than what I was going to replace it with so I left it and completed the, the painting and, and it turned out very well. called about the, um, the, the house in France. What was that called? Uh, house in France. That's what it was called, House in France? Yeah. Okay, let's talk about that one. Tell me a little bit about House in France and how that one came about. Two other fellows and myself every Saturday morning go to a little cafe downtown called La Baguette. And we'd sit there and drink coffee and eat a croissant and spend about half of Saturday mornings, have been doing this for years. And one Saturday morning I looked up and I saw this calendar with this little house and a tree on, uh, growing in the, in the picture. And I thought, gee, that would make a nice painting. So I asked the, the woman that, that ran, ran the La Bag out if I could have that painting or that picture when it, the, the month was up, so that I, I, I'll paint you a, a painting of what I would like to have there if you let me have it for a month. So I took that painting home, or the, that picture home with me, and did a painting of it, and then the next week or so, when I, we were in there on a Saturday morning, I gave her back her painting, and she was just thrilled to death. So, didn't make a dime on that one. <laughs> That's good, Don. The paintings I like most are the ones that I have done by accident. A lot of spontaneous uh, motion and, and p pigment in the colors and what have you. And I've found doing watercolors I throw away more paintings than I finish, and I start over, and I can produce five watercolors while I'm playing around with one oil painting. Anything specific about what you like to tell people about what you do? No. <laughs> <laughs> I, I find doing my work and having other people comment on it, most rewarding. Uh, some, of, some of my friends like a lot of the work that I do, and then I've got a couple of friends that, that think I'm lousy, so I have to put up with them. <laughs> too much, <laughs> but, but for television... Maybe I ought to get back there and interview you. Yeah. <laughs>